All right, today we're going to go over how to set up a user codes and user management system on the Reso. Very simple. It's on page starts on page 75 of your user manual. But to get started, you want to press the custom key. It tells you in the book that you use code 80. Then it'll tell you to press the plus key. We'll get U0, which means we need to set up a code. And now we can set up a code from anywhere from 1 to 99 users by just how we started on this. So to get to the next step, we press the plus key. We get pass entered. And I'm going to put in a code that I can remember, which is 1, 2, 3, 4. Now this is the admin code, so you definitely want to remember that code. And once you've pressed uh, that code, press plus. That's user 0. That's the ad administration, so that's me. So now I'm ready to go on to the next step. Paid. I'm going to press start. I get pass. So for me to operate this machine, I have to press my code. Two, three, four, start. And now I can operate the machine. To, to add users, it's the same way. You have to go. Custom, zero is flashing, so I hit 80 plus G1. Now I'm going to be user one plus pass, and I, now I enter the code. So user one, let's say, is four, five, six, seven plus. I'm not going to, at this point, I'm not going to set up a group for them to be in. So I press plus again, and then it goes on to user two. And you just continue that until you've hit your number of users. Again, it will hold up to 99 users. And that's all there is. Now, when I get out of this feature, I press custom. It, when anybody walks up the machine, it's gonna say pass. So they have to have a code. So I can't do anything while it says pass. So I would put in my code. Four, five, six, seven, start. Now I'm able to use the machine. And it's as simple as that. There are other features that I we would prefer you go to the manual, but you're welcome to again call us or email us. Tim at mysimplifiedoffice.com will help you walk through it. We're going to post this manual online. But uh, you can limit users, you can add, subtract users, uh, and it's all in the manual how to do it. But it's very simple. Uh, again, once I put in my code now as user one. I'm ready to go. So once I press reset, I walk away from the machine, passes it, nobody can use this machine without a code. And that's the user management system.